When a dog delivers a litter of puppies, it is common for some of them to be stillborn or die shortly after birth. If you want to deal with the death of puppies during birth, you need to give the mother some time with the dead animal. You should dispose of the animal in a way that complies with local regulations, because the death of puppies can be traumatic. You will need to deal with the loss and help your family members cope with the sad situation, if you want to prevent any deaths from birthing complications in the future. You should have your dog neutered. So, we are going to watch about the how to deal with puppy deaths during birth. Method 1. Managing stillborn puppies. First is allow the mother to spend some time with the dead puppies. If the mother or surviving pups seem ill in any way, remove the dead puppies immediately. You do not want a parasite taking advantage of their weakened immune systems. Step 2. Remove the dead animals. After you allow the mother some time to notice that the puppies are dead. Remove them from the rest of the litter. You should use a paper towel or rubber glove to grab the carcasses so that you do not infect yourself with any parasites. Finally, contact your veterinarian. If you have the placenta, include that with the dead puppies. You should then contact your veterinarian about having the dead animals tested. It is important to find out if the other litter members are at risk. Method 2. Disposing of dead puppies. First is let the veterinarian dispose of them. The vet will dispose of any dead animals for free after performing a necropsy. Depending on their facilities, they may incinerate or bury the animals. You may also request the remains if you want to dispose of the animals yourself. Step 2. Contact Animal Control. If you do not contact your veterinarian and are unsure about how to dispose the dead animals, call your local animal control. They will help you determine the best way of disposing of the carcasses. You can also take the dead puppies to your local animal services center and see if they Finally, bury. If you have small children, you may want to have a small burial ceremony. For something as small as a puppy, a shoebox should work as a coffin. You should bury the dead animal at least 2 feet, 61 centimeters, deep. Method 3. Dealing with the loss. First is cope. The death of puppies can be a difficult event to manage emotionally. You may experience sadness, anger, or even denial that the puppies passed away. Acknowledging these emotions will help you address and eventually deal with your sadness. Step 2 Explain what happened. If you have children, it is important that you talk with them about the death of the puppy or puppies. Explain to them that this is a normal and natural occurrence. Step 3 Comfort your grieving family members. Listen to your child's questions about the loss of the puppies. Let them know that it is okay to be sad and that disappointment is a normal feeling in this situation. Finally, remember your pet. You can hold a burial ceremony in your backyard or plant a special tree or flower to remember the puppies. You can ask your child to help you in the planning of the ceremony. Method 4. Preventing the death of puppies during birth. First is spay your dog. Young dogs that become pregnant are more likely to miscarry and have stillborn puppies. They are also less likely to be able to properly care for their puppies. Unless you are a professional dog breeder, you should have your dog spayed before its first heat. Step 2. Visit your veterinarian. Many dogs suffer from genetic problems that make healthy delivery of puppies difficult. If your dog is pregnant, you should set up regular veterinary checkups. Working with the veterinarian will limit the likelihood of stillborn puppies. Finally, isolate the mother for three weeks before delivery. One of the leading causes of stillborn puppies is a herpes infection. If the mother is infected while pregnant, she will likely lose the entire litter. To avoid this, isolate the mother from any other dogs for at least the last three weeks of the pregnancy. We hope it is useful to you. Please subscribe to our channel to upskill yourself.